Good morning! So we're in Santa Teresa on the Nicoya Peninsula on the coast of Costa Rica. Today we're just gonna wander around a little bit, see what this town has to offer. Hopefully we'll get some beach time, some surfing in, and we heard that there's a pretty good skate park here, so Danny's really excited about that. Aw oh, yes, lemonade at the beach. Back of the van is swarming. What is going on there? You can see next to us, fancy beach place, nice pool, and you got the ocean right there. So we decided we're just going to go take a walk around town for a bit now and take the dog of course and see what's going on around town. I'm thinking this must be a natural thing, all these swarms right now, probably after the rain. Whoa, one got you? It's flying into my shirt. Oh, what? Better than in your mouth. So Brita was attacking them too, huh? Looks like these things lose their wings and then transform. Yes, we dodged those flying ants enough that we made it to the skate park of Santa Teresa. That's the my favorite form of travel, skate park tourism. Oh, that thing looks sick. Transfer here, transfer there. Whoa, this is a good skate park. Are we gonna return then? Yeah, we have to. Look how good those transitions are. Seems really well made. Woo, well, we'll come back when it's dry, eh? Yeah. We decided to walk back along the beach. Hopefully, there's less of those swarms of wing dance and there's this cool trail here said no ATVs so, so overall I'm kind of liking Santa Teresa what about you Emily oh I love it it's super fancy it's super nice not too fancy um and not too touristy there just doesn't seem like there's that many people here from the right if you keep going when you hit the beach here and go right it would be like way more secluded I think Yeah, beautiful beach. So this would definitely be Santa Teresa. And wow, those waves. It must be around that corner there where people serve. Cause this like, these rocks here, gnarly spot to serve. made it back to the van and it looks like there's horses here they're bridled up but I guess they're free to roam that's pretty sick <laughs> anyway dinner time Somebody lost them. does anybody know whose horses these are <laughs> There's a little boy. Grammy. Van dinner for the night. Fried rice. Courtesy of the van chef wife. <laughs> she put in some of these. Heart of palm. Tasty. He's cuckoo for catnip puffs. Pretty proud of our little home right now, having our morning coffees, and we're getting really good solar right now. 170 watts out of 200, so it's going right from the sun into our phones. Time for the morning walk. Something just fell right there. Oh, we're parked just far enough away. Here's some Brita, defend you. Defend your brother. Buena chica. Not a bad spot for the morning coffee. That's good, they're playing. She really needs it. Come on in, buddy. Good boy. 
¡Sombrita! ¡Vamos! Muy bien, vamos. All these places seem deserted during the week. It's a freaking party on Sunday. Check out these places here. Pretty baller. I guess this would be Santa Teresa area. A ton of these places along the beach, but I guess they're expensive. Well, we got the van all ready. Let's go check out the town, skate park, surf, who knows? Here we Ooh. go. guys noticed in that cliff that I ran over that kid's bike after I did that transfer the first time. <laughs> well, Emily gave him a bunch of our stickers that we got BMX stickers and stuff, so I usually smooth it over when I run over a bike. Ooh, super sweaty. Time to hit the ocean. So we're checking out another beach spot here. People have said they come here with their vans during the day. We hear it's a better place for surfing, so Danny really wants to cool off a little bit, go in the water. Where we were before had just crazy waves and no one swimming, so kind of figured it was a little dangerous to swim, but here we read it was easier. Looking like a really good surf spot. So here is to hoping this puddle isn't a little mini pond. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that is a little deep. It was a bit deep. It was a little bit deep. There's a bit of roots in the middle. Nice, we've been chatting it up with that guy. And uh, he was helping us find a spot to park. Very nice guy. So I think I'm gonna put it right over here and get some solar power. <laughs> Hello, are there any hobbits in there? relaxing after playing with so many dogs. So she, now she's chewing on some sticks and I'm reading a book. There's 25 surfers out there. Some really good surfers. Yeah, let's see if we can... I'm 
from the Pacific, but I love how everybody comes out to the beach at sunset time and it just becomes such a scene. West Coast. Three years today since our wedding when we also started traveling full time. Mm -hmm. Big day today. <laughs> Celebrate. Hey. We received this book as a wedding gift to use for special days instead of buying cards every year. Well, we decided to get a closer beach spot to the fancy dinner we're going to have later. So here we can have our own drinks, our own beach club. What do you think, little boy? So you want to take a little anniversary walk? Do it! Wow, so this must be pretty low tide. All this exposed rock is full of water. Hopefully you can climb that thing right there, that'd be sick. <laughs> this side looks wild. Maybe we won't climb it. Still need a scrape on a anniversary. <laughs> Sweet rock though. And then we're gonna walk down here. Hopefully it's just like that. Flor Blanca Resort. Probably down at the point, honestly. So not too far, I think it's at a half kilometer. And that'll be a really, really fancy restaurant resort spot. 400 a night is the cheapest room, but you don't get an ocean view with that. <laughs> Playa Hermosa in Spanish, Hermosa means beautiful. And it's nice. Wow, first tide pool discovery. Lobster right there, right under the rock there. Thank you. 
lot of those guys. Well, here we are back at the van. What do you want to do, baby? You want to, I don't know, set up the sunshade, play Scrabble? Yeah, let's do it. Get that rosé out. Oh yeah, let's crack that rosé. Rosé all day. Rosé and snacks. Ooh, and let's get the cat out too. Yeah. Hopefully he'll chill. We've got Grammy in the little tent with us. We're about to play some Scrabble Goldfish Edition. Now we got this going. You want to celebrate, babe? Yeah, let's do it. Open that up. All day. But not every day. <laughs> In moderation. Mm. Stay thirsty, friends. Very nice. Well, Sombrita got to play with a dog, a couple of dogs, but one of them was scared. He comes in here. Calamity struck, and the dog came in here. It wasn't his fault, but. We messed up the board. I'm sorry I didn't put back the board. I think I actually got it, honestly. Very nice owners of the dog. They said they moved here from where, Emily? Switzerland. Wow. The most exclusive beach club. You have to be a Vanderson. Fancy dinner. Oh, this place is like a garden. This concludes the before dinner drinks portion of the dinner. Let's go see what world class cuisine they have to offer. Happy anniversary! Love you. Love you. About. He loves hair things. <laughs> the cat outside, put the dog outside. So we're about to get on the ferry from Playa Naranjo on the Nicoya Peninsula over to. Punta Arenas. The ferry is about 70 minutes long and it costs for two passengers and a car 
twenty dollars or eleven thousand colones. It's gonna be a fun ride. Bye, Nicoya Peninsula. Uh -huh. Let's check it out, eh? So there's where we left from Paqueras, but over here, I'm pretty sure that's Playa Naranjo where we spent the night. Because oh, yeah. remember, each side had like a thing you couldn't see past, yeah. and then there was these islands out front, wasn't it? Uh -huh. We spent the night like right in there, Playa Naranjo, putting it all together.